but my friend Katie told us that with the PVC, if you get sweaty feet, the steam up, so they're not actually the best to wear on a night out. Guys, I've only been in two minutes and I've already got some stuff in the basket. One, two, three, fuck it. it's Demi welcome back to my youtube channel or if you're just joining us now why is my camera not focusing because it's actually pissing me off hello honey buns it's Demi welcome back to my youtube channel or if you're just joining us now welcome today's video as you can tell by the title I'm going to be bringing you along to Primark with us it's gonna be a come shopping with me video we're gonna go to Primark because I'm a loner and have no one to go with so yous are coming with it but I know that these videos are a massive massive the thing at the minute i've never done a come to primark with us always because i feel anxiously awkward in primark like i can do a come come to poundland with me i can do like other come shop with me's but for some reason primark i just don't get the same vibe you know so we're gonna try it we're gonna see how it goes we're gonna see if the video ends up online then i thought it was decent enough to put on um but yeah i'm actually really excited i haven't been at primark in a good few weeks to be honest so i'm excited to see what they've got in i've also been watching a hell of a lot of people's primark hauls and i've really been enjoying the stuff that i see in the hauls and i want to pick some of it up for myself so today i'm just going to be doing a come to primark with me i will also be doing a primark haul if i get some stuff so that'll be a separate video of this this is just kind of a come to primark chill chat let's see what they got in so yeah let's head into primark guys i've only been in two minutes and i've already got some stuff in the basket all of the new autumn winter stuff so i feel like there's a lot that i'm gonna be getting i'll we'll do the come shop with me in primark just because it's chocker and i feel like a tit I'm not gonna lie i'm just gonna have to make do if i want to be a vlogger i'm gonna have to do this okay i'm gonna have to change the lighting on here because it actually draws her okay so this bit is very autumnal i really like that red jumper but it's got a really woolly up turtleneck so it'll make me look like i have like seven chains so we're gonna say no to that i actually seen these shoes last time i was in primark but my friend katie told us that with the pvc if you get sweaty feet the steam up so they're not actually the best to wear on a night out but i do actually really like them but yeah um i really like this orange bodysuit yeah but I wouldn't know what to pair it with. But yeah, I like looking at models for inspiration to see like how they dress them. Um, but this is like showing up really yellow toned on the camera, but it's actually like more of an orange tone. Okay, so I actually love the way that this model is styled. Like I love this outfit. The only thing that would be putting me off is replicating this full outfit on myself is the coat because I'm small long coats like this don't usually work for me very well so i feel like if you're really tall this is such a cute autumnal outfit but if you're like me and not very tall this outfit would just not work um but i really love like i'm gonna i definitely need to get some more layered necklaces because i keep losing mine but i really like that bodysuit but it's just there's too much neck to it um and the blue jeans yeah i really like that outfit but again i'm not a one for boots either so i don't think i could get away with them got all the christmas jumpers in if you need a new christmas jumper so there's lots of red themed ones got some more pugs on penguins i really like this one don't know why my camera's showing it up orange but it's red and then you've got i really like this white one as well with the reindeers on penguins i love these little cute sock things i actually seen these last year in primark i got them for stocking fillers for people um but yeah and then you've got some christmas themed t-shirts if you're more of a t-shirt type of girl over a jumper what the elf and then you've also got an elf t-shirt as well i love elf so much like i feel like i need that but i won't wear it so i'm gonna try and be good okay you've got some christmas themed ones so you have mini mouse mrs claus oh my god elf i actually need that winnie the pooh wham yeah they've got such a good selection in actually wrap and paint my vibe oh my god look at these so cute Oh my god, I love this. This is a three-in-one travel set. So it's got like a PVC big toiletry bag and then two miniature ones. One's leopard and one's gold. Um, this is £8. I actually think that's such good value because when I go away, I never have a bag big enough and this one's actually huge. I think I'm going to get this because I kind of need it. Such a good range of jumpers. I'm obsessed with this stone colour in the minute and they've got this lush jumper and that says let's do this. It's got this 
kind of open neck so you could wear a turtleneck under it um, but look at how the ends of it are all like chafed like they've gone for that style because it's on them all if not somebody's have been having a good munch of them but I love that but I just I'm not a jumper person so I don't know if I could pull it off but then they've also got like your basic crop jumpers they've got a grey one with a tie at the bottom then this like really weird colour it's like an orangey but then I really like this as well. This is just your plain string jumper. Um, it's actually really soft inside. It's quite fleecy. But this is in like a brown top colour. I really do love that colour at the minute. And then they've got all the scarves as well. I just never wear scarves, not going to lie. I just, I just don't like them. Okay, so I am not a dress type of person. But if I was, I would definitely pick this up. It's like a pink silk dress like a slip dress with like a ruffle at the front but it comes with this gorgeous like sparkle detailing belt with a tassel on the end this is how they've styled it on the model and i think it looks so cute like on a christmas night out i think that's such a vibe i like would love to pull this off but i just don't like dresses enough and plus i don't really have any christmas parties because self-employed life so i'm in bags i actually love the style of these little clutch bags they kind of remind me of the chanel ones but you have it in a stone nude color and then a really gorgeous red color and then also a black color as well i'm really drawn to the red one but i actually don't need it so these are the little bags that i've seen um quite a few people buying recently and i love them and then you do get the longer strip in the inside as well so you can wear it like over the shoulder or as like a little carry bag because I know loads of people do and then they also have that in black again I'm really drawn to the red one I feel like I want it but practically would I wear it I don't know they've also got this like snake print bag with a hoop as well quite cute a little box bag they've got a good selection of like bags in it at the moment I think especially a more average day to day one. Oh my god this is a fancy one it's got lots of different compartments I mean it's not my style but if it's your style it's quite cute I really love these because I'm going to Paris next week I feel like I want to get it just for Disneyland Paris and take it with us or even just the bum bag but I know Sean would like be like what the heck but I just think it's so cute like I actually love it but they've got all the other themed Minnie Mouse ones as well so they've got a black one or like a makeup bag one oh my god this actually fascinates me like it looks like a gym bag that men wear or have but it's obviously like a tiny version um additional long-handed strap inside it's only eight pound but I'm just like what it's like the weirdest oddest looking little bag I've seen but I'm kind of living for it but like, I just wouldn't know what the hell to do with that that's quite cute and then we have some like monogram like you have a monogram clutch here and then they also have it in the backpack style as well I love it how if they do a pattern they do it in a few different styles so like you can get what you want okay guys so we are on my personal favorite floor the home decor and Christmas orientated floor it is like my favorite by far um clothes and that are fun but home decor is just the thing that I love so um yeah I've got a basket full of stuff so there's definitely gonna be a haul but yeah oh my god I'm so excited okay so let us see what they have it's very old Christmas orientated as you'd expect we're in November well we're not we're nearly in November but look at these mini spinner mugs how cute you've got a little trinket dish Disney themed Dia Santa to put these mince pies and stuff on love that oh my god look at this candle all Christmas themed with little what is that? Is that like, oh, Christmas tree trucks. Let me see, give it a sniff test. It's just vanilla. Okay, it smells of vanilla. Then we also have Mickey and Minnie mug set. So we have a full section here catered out to Disney. And then I think we have a friend section as well. See, the thing is with friends, like I never watch it, but I love the aesthetic of friends. Like I love the pattern of the stuff, but I just don't watch it. And you've got some little tins here, little glass cans, friends on, a little coffee maker. Love that, all friend themes. Oh my god, now you've got some really cozy throws. Like if I get one of these, Dolly will be, well she already lives on my bed, but she'll live on my bed even more. I feel like I want new bedding, not gonna lie. I feel like it's time for an upgrade. I actually desperately need a new sheet. I am the worst with sheets, like I just, ooh, maybe a grey one. Mm, I don't know, my white one's awful, uh, not my white one, my black one, I don't like black ones. That's a single, a single, maybe I need to go to the other side for a double. Oh my god, look at this mean, mean girls themed cup. I'm not a regular mum, I'm a cool mum. Oh my god, I love that. And then you've also got some mean girls shot glasses as well, and then you did have a Lion King set of two mugs, but someone's nicked a mug. 
and then you've got AT. Oh my god, I love that Bambi mug. Love it. Okay, I desperately want a new duvet cover set. They've got so many. Oh my god, look at the Lion King one. I actually love that. Is it appropriate to get that? I feel like at 23 it's not appropriate for me to have that, but I really want it. So moving on to Christmassy themed stuff. Look at these little napkins. I love these. Oh my god. And then you've got like little tartan placemats. Um, they've got quite a good selection of like tableware to be fair. And then they have your traditional gold and red um, bauble set. I love this. I'm obsessed with this tartan cushion. Oh my god, it's actually so soft as well. I feel like I want this. That's what I want, just tartan bedding like that, like proper Christmas. And then they also have a present sack. It like, looks like an elf, it's really cute. Um, so moving on to like homeware. Oh my god, they've got some wine glasses, but they're kind of ombre with gold. I love that. And then they've got some little Christmas candles, little tea candles, so cute. Um, they've got so much stuff in. Like look at these table center pieces and then they've got loads of big candles that you can put in them as well so they have a cinnamon and apple candle which is red you can also get it with like all the acorn, acorn and that on the top of pine cones and then they have vanilla and clove as well which is a green themed one then in here you have a warm winter wishes butter scotch and cream candle this is actually so cute as a little gift for someone it's three pound fifty so if you know a candle lover and you're doing a secret santa Primark's the place to be. Oops, I need them. And then we have some Christmas baubles, Santa baubles. We have some Christmas gift bags. Oh no, it's a box. Feel here, so you've got the navy and silver. Lots of different things. Um, you can get the lead candles as well if you want Santa pieces. You can get them in red as well. Good selection of stuff. And then we also have like the gold and orange themed baubles here as well. I love that. Oh, and then if you want to go for kind of the pastel pink, blue, gold theme, it's here. Oh, a pink little Christmas tree. I'll actually need to get a little Christmas tree for my office eventually. Here's me. I look an absolutely atrocious today. I've literally just got jeans on with like Primark cardigan. As you can see, my basket is full. Like I look atrocious. Moving on. I actually like these for travelling. I bought myself one in the airport once and it was literally 12 quid. I bet you they're not 12 quid in Primark. How much are these? Seven pounds. I paid nearly double for a literally a plain one in the airport as well. Really gutted about that. I really love that one. I don't know. Um, oh my God, who is that? Donald Duck. Love that. Yeah, I want this fake plant. It's £18 and I've got two reasons why I don't know if I should buy it. One, I don't know how to carry it to the car. Like, it's quite a big thing to carry to the car. My car's not the closest to where I am. Two, I'm not sure how Andrea would feel, but I mean, it's going in my room. But I just think fake plants are, like, such a thing at the minute. And I really like this one as well. And then you've got this one, which is in a little gold stand. But that's too, like, dainty for me. Like, that one with the big leaves is what I want. But I don't know if I'm going to get it. I want that. I'm definitely going to come back and get it when I have the office. So I think I'm moving into the office on the 18th of November. Um, and then I'm going to obviously go to Ikea, deck it out, go to Home Bargains, get all my stuff. I definitely want some fake plants in it, but I just feel like... But then I know if I don't get them, when I come back to get them, they'll be out of stock. But I feel like I shouldn't get it yet, but I really want it. So do you know the dilemma I'm in? I might get it. Oh, I don't know. So I just came out of Primark. I got a big bag of stuff, so I will be doing like a separate haul on that. Um, I'm going to pop to Pret and see if they've got any vegan stuff left. Usually at this time they don't, but I'm going to try my chances. I really love the olive tomato and avocado sandwich. That's kind of what I'm hoping they've got there. Um, but yeah, it's dark. Went into Primark and it was light and it's, now it's dark. I've only been in like about an hour, an hour and a half, but I came quite late on, so... Yeah, um, I always feel dead vulnerable without my glasses because I literally can't see people or things until they're like right in front of us. Like I'm so blind without my glasses, so I feel really awkward without them. But also, I'm kind of regretting not getting that fake plant. I really want it. What is that massive queue of people for? It's like a massive queue of people, and I'm not sure what. They're... Oh, it's from Magic Box. You know the um, Halloween shop. Look at the big queue of people. Oh, my friend Caitlin actually works there. Should be so chock, God bless her. Oh my God. Okay, let me see if they have my vegan sandwich. I don't even know what time Pret shot. Oh man. They've got the avocado on toast, but I don't really like that. Um, uh, 
have the veggie sweet potato box. I don't really want that either. No, I'm out of luck. So now I have two options. I can go to, I need to go, I want to film them videos where you get your makeup done at a makeup counter, but I have just realised it is Halloween tonight and I feel like, I feel like that, blah, 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 I can't fucking speak. I feel like with it being Halloween tonight, that the makeup counters are going to be full so i might head there first thing in the morning to get my makeup done i might go and see me nana and granddad because i haven't seen them in a long time and i do have an hour and a bit to kill before the gym plus i need to change into my gym clothes which i have got with us because i'm such a little organized person that i brought my gym stuff with us um so that i could change into them because i knew i probably wouldn't have time to go back home because yeah um but yeah i got a whole bunch of stuff in primark i've got like a big bag which i am going to be doing a haul on so stay tuned for that this is like a come shop with me but we will have a haul as well um i'm going to paris on monday very excited but i need a pack like i'm the last minute person i just if i don't need to do something i put it off and put it off till the last minute and then i'm like shit i need to do that so i'm going to i got myself from costa an ice latte and a breakfast vegan burrito because i've had nothing to eat it's 355 calories i'm gonna have that for my tea and then after the gym later on i'll usually have like a banana or something so i'm gonna have that then go to the gym no i'm gonna have that go and see me nana then go to the gym but yeah this was my primark come shopping with me i've never done a primark come shopping with me before and honestly i'll tell you why because it's really bloody awkward like there's so many people there people look at you you feel like a tit why are you holding this camera why are you talking to yourself why are you talking to the clothes some people probably think like people must think i'm a nutter if you're not like in the youtube industry if you don't get it then i think people will look at us and think like you do get quite a few funny looks and i'm just like <laughs> and then people like smile at you to say oh bless her she obviously got issues so they're probably like and you're just like mm, hi oh god anyway I feel like other shops I'm not so bothered like Poundland and stuff I don't feel that bothered about it because I just it's a different vibe of people do you know what I mean but as soon as I have to do a come shop with me in, in Primark I feel really really like um okay I've just literally gone full-on Terry I mode I don't know why I've done that but I am like does anybody else just do one and things like that and then because I record myself a lot of the time and I watch my footage back I'm like what was that like sometimes i feel like i'm not even subconsciously like in my body like a terrier clearly took over my body there that was not me a terrier was in my body there anyway moving on this is my come shop with me if you want to see more primark come shop with me give this one a thumbs up subscribe down below if you think no demi this video was absolutely rubbish stick to the hauls hun then that is what i will do but i hope you like the come shop with me because yeah i quite enjoyed it i felt like a tit but it was quite fun um but yeah i will see you very shortly for another video bye